A reading from the book of Exodus. Having set out from Alim, the whole Israelite community came into the desert of Sin, which is between Alim and Sinai, on the fifteenth day of the second month after their departure from the land of Egypt. Here in the desert, the whole Israelite community grumbled against Moses and Aaron. The Israelites said to them, Would that we had died at the Lord's hand in the land of Egypt as we sat by our flesh pots and ate our fill of bread. But you had to lead us into this desert to make the whole community die of famine. Then the Lord said to Moses, I will now rain down bread from heaven for you. Each day the people are to go out and gather their daily portion. Thus, I will test them to see whether they follow my instructions or not. On the sixth day, however, when they prepare what they bring in, let it be twice as much as they gather on the other days. So Moses and Aaron told all the Israelites, At evening you will know that it was the Lord who brought you out of the land of Egypt, and in the morning you will see the glory of the Lord as he heeds your grumbling against him. But what are we that you should grumble against us? When the Lord gives you flesh to eat in the evening, continued Moses, and in the morning your fill of bread, as he heeds the grumbling you utter against him, what then are we? Your grumbling is not against us, but against the Lord. Then Moses said to Aaron, Tell the whole Israelite community, Present yourselves before the Lord, for he has heard your grumbling. When Aaron announced this to the whole Israelite community, they turned toward the desert, and lo, the glory of the Lord appeared in the cloud. The Lord spoke to Moses and said, I have heard the grumbling of the Israelites. Tell them, in the evening twilight you shall eat flesh, and in the morning you shall have your fill of bread, so that you may know that I, the Lord, am your God. In the evening quail came up and covered the camp. In the morning a dew lay all about the camp, and when the dew evaporated there on the surface of the desert were fine flakes like hoarfrost on the ground. On seeing it, the Israelites asked one another, What is this? For they did not know what it was. But Moses told them, This is the bread which the Lord has given you to eat. Now this is what the Lord has commanded. So gather it, that everyone has enough to eat, an omer for each person, as many of you as there are, each man providing for those of his own tent. The Israelites did so. Some gathered a large and some a small amount. But when they measured it out by the omer, he who had gathered a large amount did not have too much. And he who had gathered a small amount did not have too little. They so gathered that everyone had enough to eat. The Israelites ate this manna for forty years until they came to settled land. They ate manna until they reached the borders of Canaan. <laughs> 